So we're already like in the fifth round, right? Not fifth round. We're like in the fifth pick. Orlando's about to make their pick right now, but I, I decided I might as well talk about pick number three. Jaleel Okafor got picked up by the Philadelphia 76ers. Now, this is definitely something that I did not see coming. Hold up, let's see where let's see where Orlando's gonna pick right here. I know this is the So they get a shooting guard from Croatia, whatever, man. I don't know, man. Whatever, it's cool, it's cool, it's cool. Um, yeah, that's who the Orlando Magic pick. Obviously, number four, the New York Knicks picked some tall dude uh, from overseas who could shoot the rock. So, you know what? Congrats to Orlando. Congrats to the Knicks. I feel bad for the Knicks, man. Not, I mean, I don't know how the, if the guy's good or bad. I just feel bad for the fans because I saw a fan crying. But we'll see how these players end up playing. Julia Local for who's, who we're talking about right now. They obviously picked two really legitimate big men in the past couple of years. Nerlens Noel, Joel Embiid. So, now they're obviously picking up another player. I'm going to be honest with you guys. I think this is a great pick for Philadelphia. I don't care if they already had two big men. Joel Embiid's not even confirmed to play next year. You got to pick. If you're a team, you got to pick pick the best player out there, right? Obviously, the top three players were Towns, Jaleel, and obviously Russell. Russell got picked. Towns got picked. You got to pick up the third best player. And I don't. And even though you already have two big players, you got to pick up the next player. Because that's just how it is. That's how basketball works. It's like, it's, let me give you a nice example. It's like having Michael Jordan, LeBron James, Kevin Durant, and then, let's see. And then, like, who's another player, man? And then, like, David Lee. No disrespect to David Lee, but obviously number one would be either LeBron, Kobe, whatever, Russell Westbrook, I mean, uh, Durant. And then you got either, like, one of those three, and then David Lee. Obviously, you're going to pick one of those three, even though you might have... You know what I mean, man. That was a horrible analogy, but you know what I mean, man. You got to pick up the third best player, or, you know, one of the best players, because Jaleel was arguably number one worthy, right? Jaleel was arguably number one worthy, obviously number two worthy. He had to go number three, all right? Any other player was guaranteed to go under number three. Great pick for Philadelphia, but I want to see what you guys think about this if you're Philadelphia 76ers fans. You guys should be happy, honestly, but obviously this is some pretty big things. I probably won't make a video on New York since it already came. What do you guys think about the Knicks pick? But this is some big stuff, man. Obviously, now we're going to see what Sacramento's going to be picking and all the other teams. But yes, Jaleel Okafor going to the 76ers. Let me know what you guys think. Peace.